8.10 in the morning and today is December 9th, 2018 and I'm at this Yishin restaurant having my breakfast. Let's do it. It's very cold. It's very cold. It's very cold. But first of all, I want to show you what you get in complimentary breakfast at this place. So, I've finished my coffee. Ka chuka and these guys ask you a day in advance what do you want to have so I said I'll have uh, toast and egg and these everything which comes is all complimentary and this all that you get is seven dollars which is roughly around 550 rupees now before it gets cold I'm gonna have my breakfast so it's about 12 o'clock in the afternoon about to get 12 and um Hiking to Namtok waterfall in Sipo. That's one of the best places that you can get. It's a bigger waterfall. I didn't want to do the trek, so I came out here. There's a restaurant out here, and he is making samosas. Aapka naam kya hai, bhai? Russian. Russian bhai, Nepal se hai? Yes. Oh, namaste, Russian bhai ko. Yeh inki family hai. Beti hai Hindi nahi bolti hai. Inko sikhao Hindi bolna. Hey, Mishibu. Mingla ba. <laughs> it's really nice to see when you see your, you know, people and they make the similar food that is, you don't think would be available. And this samosa is not going to be available today, otherwise I would have tried. But for now, we're going to head to the waterfall, see how it is. Thank you, my dear. Where are you headed? Ah, waterfall, Namtuk. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. This is the symmetry. And... From Yishin guest house, it's not that far. We barely walked half an hour and we are already here. He is gonna do Shan village, but on his own, Joan. From Barcelona. From Barcelona. Hello, hola a todos. Hola a todos. Okay. Hola a todos, no, hello to everyone. Oh, hello to everyone. So, hello to everybody. And yeah, we're gonna do some sightseeing together. We were there in Mandle together. We bump in at the railway station. So we are not there yet, but if you can see that is you know largest waterfall in Sipo. These are the corn fields, they dry it out and then probably they use it for the flower. And I see all the sunflowers all across out here. So it's a beautiful sight. And keep walking. And I hope... Ah, forget to tell you there are some, some of the caves out here that I've heard about. Uh, some of the friends that I met uh, from uh, Europe told me about it. They couldn't go because like too sketchy sometimes. But I would try and see if we we can get to the caves as well spend some good time and then head towards the you know hot pool and yeah finish our day so we are crossing through in the village these are traditional myanmar people and bananas are pretty common out here and just the way we have in india and i bought some it did cost me like 30 25 rupees for Half a dozen, I guess. Something that I really like about Myanmar or Burmese people is like they are really close to the nature. All green things all around. Which is good food, good vibes, and smiling people. You might have seen my previous video uh, when we were there in, uh, you know, looking for Amor Falcon and Woka. So you can pretty much eat this stuff. Uh, in Nagaland they make it for jam and all sort of different stuff. I'm gonna see if there are flies in it or not. Okay. Oh wow. Finally we have reached the waterfall. I see the caves out there. If you see the Buddha statues. There's this one right up there, one's up there, I can see a number of them. 
But first, I must head to the waterfall. I don't want to jump into it, but oh. but I do want to pick a dip inside. Let's see, definitely I'll go and pick a dip inside. So I had a great time at the waterfall. It's amazing. The water is just cold, not icy, but cold. It refreshes you. Uh, the walk is very nice. Yeah. yeah, I'm slipping. Yeah, the water is very nice. Wow. Okay. So I had a good bath at the waterfall. The water is deep, so not try to go much inside. There are rocks that you can hold on to and take a good swim. Good people around. Everybody out there. Ah. Welcome to Myanmar. Okay, so now I'm done with the waterfall. I'm heading towards the cave, spending one day in the uh, Sipa and trying to utilize the best. <laughs> 